it's a day in my life at home and uh we're just getting ready i still just want to go brush my teeth so i'm gonna run some errands i don't want to do anything specific and also there's like youtube that i want to catch up with what are we doing we're getting we're going to the dentist getting some food in my stomach oh this is the ootd ootd yeah 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 I'm so happy i'm so i don't know what's the word i think also really excited to see my channel like growing i went from 71 subscribers to 109 subscribers just from one day of posting like that's so crazy um but i'm also very thankful and very grateful for like the people who support me because I know a lot of the people who watched my video are like people I know personally and I know it's people who genuinely enjoy my content and like it's people who have been telling me Finze please get onto like YouTube like we don't know how you don't have a YouTube channel and I'm like I used to have one I used to have one but yeah I'm so thankful and I'm so grateful like the the support is just so humbling like the fact that I have like a circle of friends who are just so supportive and i just like just want, want to see me win and then like they see me doing my stuff and then they're like oh my gosh <laughs> that's so crazy it's so crazy i don't know this is like the content that i like watching because it's like so it like it gives me a dose of inspiration and motivation it looks sick for me because like all those motivational videos that are like oh god blah, 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 like all of those i don't like them but like seeing someone be productive like just do what they enjoy do what like challenges them and then they rise to the challenge that for me is so motivational like i'm just like oh my goodness i haven't run in how many days i'm going for my run today i am going for my run what is that youtuber i did see the youtuber radio like and, and the thing is i know people say like radio's dead blah 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 and i'm like is radio really dead or is it that i just don't listen to radio because like there's that show yeah uh who's this the 702 show yeah the upside of failure goodness that's so beautiful then there's there's okay what's up on ymfm then there's radio 2000 i love radio 2000 in general in general like I just love to radio, like radio in the car. Let's make reservations for two. This is just between me and you. And I Tonight, you're mine. Tonight, I'm gonna be completely honest.
it's like guys i grew up i grew up with this kind of music right like these love ballads and honestly like all i want i feel like all i want guys is just someone to enjoy these kind of mu this kind of music with like i don't care if you i don't care if you love clear soul i don't care if you love georgia smith i don't care if you love like frank ocean or whoever right like whoever is our generation of whatever but I could enjoy this kind of music with me Like just like an old soul They gave me a spot immediately Now I can't feel one side of my face I'm comparing it to the purple one, Yanis Cafe. Mm. Not bad, really not bad. Just the perfect, like, I don't like my coffee too strong. This one is just the perfect amount of brew and milk and flavor and the chocolate flavor. The chocolate flavor is essential. Mmm, yum, yum, yum.
This was around the area of Guadalupe, which appears to be the Kasi around of the area. It was quite interesting to to see because I don't know. I've never seen a case in Kasi. One thing my mom and I notice is that they usually have like a big yard and then have multiple people living in the same yard. But because there's so many people, it, just, it looks small. I think this shows you the importance of traveling and traveling doesn't really have to be overseas or somewhere far but just getting to see different lifestyles and getting to see different parts of the country because most of us just know KZN as Durban or Peter Maritzburg. I think this is also really great for interpersonal skills you know when you're engaging with someone and they say to you they from what to you can say, oh, you live 50 kilometers away from Gateway. And they're like, oh my goodness, how did you know that? You know, and you kind of have this thing, this connection now. It's like speaking to someone in their language. And in typical South African fashion, we're minutes away from the suburbs. So we also got to see the suburban area. says that we're not gonna go to the mall like it's too late now we're gonna have to just drive back home without going to the mall i feel like if you don't understand me i live in a small town the only time i get a chance to go to the mall is when i'm in the city and i give up like so big but no Yana have a good time I is like it's so beautiful. I love the trees in Kazadin. I I think Kazadin is so pretty. Like we just went to the graveyard. Yeah, Mune. And it's like the graveyard, yeah, hiking spot. Like I don't know, it just looks so cool. It's like these trees and it's uphill. Just... and it's green that's another thing it's very green right now i have a headache like, i have a headache and i'm not sure if or if i'm tired or if it's dehydration because i've been drinking water This is me after my facial. That was so nice. I still have the pimple there, but like Iranian and I have zero blackheads. Which is really nice. But yeah. That was the most relaxing. I don't know how long I've been in here, but that was so relaxing. That was so nice. They even did my eyebrows. I asked them to do my eyebrows. Man, I would do that again. I would recommend it. I loved it. Wow. Who was I before facials? Wow. Mmm. Skin glowing.